Shipmakers and Sheep Punchers, this is Jury Duty Summons, and today I'd like to talk with you about redstone clocks. A redstone clock is used to cause a uh, repeat, cause a, um, a blink essentially, a blink effect. And uh, they're pretty simple to set up, and I'll show you, I'm going to show you here the basic um, kind of functionality of it, and then we'll talk a little bit about why it works, and um, I think I just set this up wrong. <laughs> of course. All right, let's just do it uh, like that. All right, so this is a this is what they call a five clock. This is a pretty basic one here, and then we'll go like that, like that. Okay, and so if you've been paying attention to redstone, you'll notice that a torch provides power, and then when a block that a torch is attached to is powered the torch it's on is turned off and so we're going to use that ability here to our advantage oops not that way if i knew what i was doing this would work a lot better huh <laughs> all right so as you can see now it's blinking the reason why it blinks like this is that there is a delay between the time that this block gets power and this torch toggles either off to on and so because of that delay it creates a cycle of these blocks being turned on and off and so you can attach something to that let's say that and you can cause something to, to take effect so in this event in this case here i just have a torch blinking on and off we can attach that to a door or a dispenser or um, railroad track any number of things all right, so there is other ways to do this. Let me show you another way. You can use the new redstone repeater blocks. So I can set this up properly here. Oh, what am I doing here? So the redstone repeater blocks work basically the same. Um, the only difference is that they don't activate. They're, they're, since nothing in here is providing power, you're going to have to provide it the initial jolt of power. But that is no problem. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of that. There we go. These have the additional advantage of being adjustable. So it, I'll just use a torch to provide the first shot of power. And so that initial pulse is just being put in a cycle now. And if you ever interrupt the flow, it doesn't start back up until you've provided another pulse. So this one's self-starting. And if you ever need it to be faster, you can go a uh, three clock, which is done. Um, how do I do that again? Uh, right there, and I'll say right there. Close enough. <laughs> Good enough. Whatever. Pfft, whatever. All right, so power there, power there, and then there we go. That's about as fast as you can do with torches, but it has that problem. It'll burn out. You can do the same thing with these. Yes, you can. Don't let it be cow. I think you can actually just do it with one, but uh, or with two rather. And so we'll provide the initial power. Whoops, I didn't do it quick enough. So there you go. That's still about a three clock though. Let's see if we can narrow that down just a bit. So just two delays. So this would be a two clock here. Tough to get started. There we go. So that's about as fast as you can get these things to flash. Um, you can use multiple flash, you know, um, clocks on alternating circuits, though. And so this is how you increase the time, but you end up breaking it, though. <laughs> and so as, I think I've talked about it before, but each notch. So that's the that's the fastest setting. 
each notch adds another unit of time equal to the amount of time for that to come on once that block's powered. So that's one that's one tick essentially to call it. And so that would be two ticks. There we go. That's these are both on two ticks. So the entire cycle is four ticks. There we go. So there we go. That is the basic redstone clocks. And if there's any questions, let me know in the comments field. I'll try my best to answer. I can't always answer your questions. A lot of times I get things like, it's not, it's broken, what, why is it not working? And I, I can't, there's nothing I can do with that. You know, if, if it's something that's not working, sometimes I, I gotta see what's going on or I gotta have the issue, you know, described rather than just, it's not working. Um, but in any event, have a nice day, everybody.